I'm Laura Spence, K-12 STEM Specialist, and I'm excited to tell you about a free night that we'll be hosting with the district's initiative called Level Up. We're gonna take a look at some of these materials you already have in your home and how it continues STEM learning after the school day. So let's take a look at one for example. A lot of people have matchbox cars. You can do a lot with these. You can take index cards, you can have your child redesign it, and look outside the window. Look at the design of the cars that are currently there. Look at them in their neighborhood. See how they're similar or different. You can even test them down ramps that you have with books in your home. Another thing that we all have in our home, Legos. Legos are a great way to build bridges, to build structures, to look at the design process. And it gets your kids thinking about what's in front of them and then what could be outside of their home. So once they build, you want them to look at their community. Finally, the last thing that many of us grew up with are parachute people. Parachute people are a great way to look at wind design. And you can take coffee filters, tissue paper, foil, anything that you have at home, and you can have them redesign the parachute part. And then they can test it out outside. And that way it's getting them thinking about STEM indoors and what it means outside. During our virtual session, we're going to start talking about what is STEM education and the basics of STEM. Then each parent and caregiver will have an option to go to two different sessions throughout the night with a variety of different materials. We'll close out the night by sharing ways that your children can use the district's technology devices to continue STEM learning at home. And to learn more about this exciting event, visit the district STEM website. And I'll see you virtually on Monday, March 29th at 6 p.m.